Instagram's Reels new editor has made adding text to Reels easier than ever. In this video, I'm gonna share with you some tricks for adding text to your Instagram Reels. Hi, I'm Wonderful Ida, an educational video producer based in Vancouver, Canada. Do you wanna get started with Instagram Reels but feel overwhelmed when it comes to gear and coming up with real ideas? Well, I've got a special treat for you. I created a free Reels blueprint so you can create your next 10 Reels within five minutes. Follow the link below to download your free blueprint now. We're gonna go into Instagram Reels and we're gonna start by adding our video. So we can't start by adding our text. We need to have some kind of video or photos first and then we can add our text after those clips are there. So I'm just gonna swipe up and I'm going to add just this. So this is just a plain one color so I can add text on top of that. So we're also going to add some talking head with some captions because if you add captions to you talking, it's gonna increase the likelihood that somebody who watches your reel without audio is going to still watch your reel because they know what you're saying. So there you go, I have my two clips recorded. So if you're just in this module which allows you to record, you just have to press next. And then once the menu is on top, you're able to add your text and your captions there, or you can go into edit clips and then you can add it through there. So if you're adding it through this way where your menu is on top, you'll see that text is right here at the end and I can write, add my text. I can move my text around. I can press the plus button here at the bottom to add more text. And what I do suggest is that you just add the text that you wanna add right here with the plus button and just have it all there so that when you go into the edit module, it's easy just to arrange everything. So I, you know what? I'm gonna actually delete this text and I'm gonna add a joke for you. So to delete the text, I just click on the text and I drag down to the garbage can. One second, I'll be right back. I'm gonna find you a joke. So ChatGPT gave me a cool joke, so I'm gonna add that. So I'm gonna add the text. Once I write the text, I also have all these options up top so I can align them to one side. There you go. I can change the color of it. I can also customize the color from something that's in the video itself. Add a background to it, switch the colors of the background. I don't usually use this type out thing because it doesn't always work, but if you want this, I guess it could work for this one because it's asking a question. Okay, so let's do that. And then it's plus, I'm gonna add the next text, which is gonna be the answer. So I'm gonna get rid of that background. Once all my text is added, then I click on edit clips. So you can see, I'm just gonna pause that. So you can see each of the text is going to appear on a different layer. So it's gonna be a lot easier for you to adjust the text. This first clip of just the background is a little too short for me to add my joke. So I'm just gonna click on that and just expand it so it's a little bit longer so I can have my joke in the beginning. And then I'm just gonna click off of it. I can also, once I click off, you can see here at the bottom, add text. So it's just another quick way for you to add text. So I'm going to click on the first one and I want this to appear first. So once I click on it, the yellow indicators are gonna show me where the text is gonna appear. So I want to zoom out of this timeline just so I can see it a little bit better. So I'm just gonna, pinch that so I can see the entire timeline. This way I can move the indicator lines a little bit better. And then I'm gonna click on the end of that indicator line and you can see when I go to where these clips cut, I see that yellow indicator. That allows me to quickly cut it right where I need to so I know that it's not going to have that text go on to the next clip and it's just gonna end there. I'm just gonna do the same thing for the bottom one so that they both end at the same time. And then if you wanna just fine tune where it begins, cause I don't want my answer to be there the same time as my questions, just so it has like some time in there. I can zoom in and this is just gonna give me a little bit more control. And then I can move that. The typing doesn't get it out fast enough. So I'm just gonna click on that and I'm gonna to go to edit. I'm just gonna get rid of the typing just so it's, ah, oh, there we go. So there I have my text right there. And now to add, my caption, I can go a couple ways. So first ways I can just go to sticker here 
and then I'll see captions right there. Or I can, when I'm back in this menu, in the menus up top, I can use the happy face and then my captions are gonna be right there. Once you click on that captions, it's just gonna take a moment to transcribe it. And then when you click on it, you can see all your text. So here I can edit which text I want to appear word for word. Let's say that is good. And then I can edit the type of style. So the reason we're not seeing it right now is because I don't start talking until later on and this is pause. So I'm just gonna go back here and press play. So you can see now it has um, my text, it's starting here and I can actually see my text. So if I click on the captions and I press edit, I can click on it and I can change the style for it. So there we go, there's the first style. Second style has a typewriter. There we go. There's the second style. There's the third style. And then I can choose which one I want. So if I hold down on that text, it's going to give me all those words again so I can edit those. If we watch this from the beginning, the captions are going to start right at the beginning. So what I can do is I can use this yellow indicator and just move it. Let's just zoom this out a little bit so I can see better. Click on it and then just move it to the beginning of that so it doesn't actually start the captions until my face appears in there. So I'm gonna press play. So there you have it. So I have my text and my captions and I can add multiple layers. And one more thing I wanna show you. So say here at the beginning, I want it to actually read this out loud. So to do that, I'm just gonna click on the text and I'm gonna select text to speech. This is gonna give me two voice options. Let's do one voice so it's like, and then a second voice for the second one. So text to speech, voice two. So it's a male and a female voice. There we go. And let's play this. What's a YouTube video's favorite sport? Channel surfing. <laughs> So there you have it. So now you know how to add text, align it really quickly, add text to speech, all in the new editor. Do you wanna get started with Instagram Reels but feel overwhelmed when it comes to gear and coming up with real ideas? Well, I've got a special treat for you. I created a free Reels blueprint so you can create your next 10 Reels within five minutes. Follow the link below to download your free blueprint now. And remember, messy action is always better than no action. Till next time, peace.